Soul Mirror. Item number, SCP-242. Object Class, Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. Due to the fact that SCP-242 is a non-sentient and an active object, relatively little security is needed for it. However, due to Incident 242-1, see additional notes, it has been determined that any personnel wishing to use this SCP must have at least Level 2 authorization and have undergone psychological examination. Description SCP-242 is a small hand mirror, roughly 12 centimeters wide and 27 centimeters long, including a 10 centimeter handle. The frame is gold filigree embedded with diamonds. Any person peering into the mirror will see not their reflection, but their true nature. SCP-242 reveals a person's innermost personality and leaves no doubt as to what kind of person the holder is. Although the subject using SCP-242 understands what they are seeing, it has been consistently described as difficult to describe to others. This makes it impossible to determine how it can convey such complex thoughts through a single image. Dr. Blank has suggested SCP-242 may employ mimetic forms of communication. Additional Notes Incident 242-1 Previously, SCP-242 did not require authorization for access. On blank, staff member blank used SCP-242. Seconds after he entered, SCP-242 was thrown violently through the room's window, and the staff member screamed. Blank seemed severely upset by what he had seen, and before other personnel could intervene, proceeded to commit suicide by slashing his throat with a shard of glass. Despite going through a window and slamming into a wall, SCP-242 was not damaged. SCP-242 reclassified as Euclid following this incident. <laughs>